What is going on, everybody? Erock here, bringing you guys a brand new video. Hope you guys are all having uh, a wonderful day. Today's video, uh, we are doing a tier list. Now, I've done tier lists on uh, legends. I've done tier lists on weapons. And since like tier lists have been kind of popping lately, um, and I've seen this specific tier list kind of going around a little bit, I thought it'd be kind of fun to do my uh, like uh, my own personal thoughts on the heirlooms in apex legends so today we're doing a, a short little tier list of what i think the heirlooms like how they look and everything in this game so if you guys do enjoy the content on this channel make sure you are leaving likes commenting sub subscribing all that stuff is absolutely free and uh, if you are uh, interested in watching any twitch streams live twitch.tv slash erock um feel free to jump on jump on over to that community be a part of it as well so without further ado, um, so this is my own personal opinion. I'll leave a link to uh, to this one in the description box down below if you guys want to do it yourself or um, follow along with me and do it, whatever you choose to do. Uh, there's not many here. So uh, first things first, this is the new Bangalore heirloom. Uh, I, me personally, I only have one heirloom. I'm... I've been maxed out at level 500 for I can't tell me tell you how long how much money I've put into this game I still I've only gotten one heirloom and uh, I have the octane heirloom but we'll get to that so Bangalore's heirloom it feels like like it looks cool and everything but I feel like they're trying too hard to like copy the knife type thing that they did with wraiths um, I feel like not everyone should have a knife right like everyone should have their own typical thing like mirage has a statue it's kind of stupid but in my opinion yeah but um i'm gonna put bangalore's in b for now um bloodhounds the the axe this thing is absolutely insane i think this is one of the best ones in my own personal opinion um i'm gonna i may be biased because currently in the state of the game i am a bloodhound main I could be completely biased, but I think I think the, the, the axe looks looks absolutely ridiculous, like so good. Um, but uh, moving on, the caustic hammer. I think this thing is stupid. Um, caustic mains out there going to be mad at me. I think it's kind of stupid. I think it is uh, the worst one out of all of them. I think they could have done something maybe better. I don't it's just like it's so big when he's running around. I know caustic's a big character. I'm not a huge fan of the big hammer. Again, that's just me. Um, but and then like same thing with with Gibby's. Is this is this supposed to be a club or a hammer? I don't really remember what they said this specifically was. Um, I I really personally to me, I'm not a huge fan of these. I think they're. I, mean, I, don't, I don't know. There's something about them that. They're, they're just not as cool, I guess, in a sense. Um, all right, I'm going to move Bangalore's up to A. I'm going to put Lifeline's drumsticks. The drumsticks are a cool idea. They do pretty cool animations and everything when they're spinning around. And I think, like, when you strike something or melee and you hit someone or an object, like, doesn't, like, electricity come off of them or something? That's pretty cool. Um, hats off to the drumsticks. They're, they're, they're average. They're not the best, but they're, they're definitely not the worst. Um, so moving on to Mirage's little statue. It's a cool idea. It's funny that it, it I mean, it is funny. Like it's Mirage is literally a statue of himself. I get it. It's fun. It's cool. Um, but like when you combine it or compare it to like the the heirloom of bangalores or even the drums i don't think it competes as much i'm gonna throw it in c maybe maybe i'll do this for now i think the hammer is stupid that's just me maybe i'll put those two together octane's butterfly uh butterfly knife the, the way octane flips it around it moves it around and it's got the little steam thing and it's mm, the this one is is top tier i think um it's the butterfly spinning and everything. That's something I would never be able to do in like 150 years or something. I could never do anything like that. Um, Pathfinder's boxing gloves. Um, See, I started off this game being a Pathfinder main. And I wanted Pathfinder's 
heirlooms to look so cool and be so cool. But if I I haven't personally used these, but people that I know have this, they find the animation, like the sound of the boxing gloves kind of like annoying. I haven't, I don't know if that's still a thing, but it's just like boxing gloves. Like they're cool, but they're not like super cool. I I might put them in like the same range as, as the drumsticks. Like they're cool, but they're not overly cool. These these ones down here, they just don't blow me away. They're, they're they just seem kind of meh. And uh obviously the the OG Wraith knife heirloom. I want to throw it in S just because it's got the cool glow, it's got the cool spins and everything. Um but maybe I don't know if I should move it down, but I feel like I should keep it in S tier because it's like it was the original OG. But here's the thing. Is it too like is it too overhyped kind of thing? Do you guys think do you guys think the Wraith heirloom is is kind of like over uh, overhyped maybe I'm going to do this. Maybe this will hurt some people's feelings. I'm going to put it in A, but I'm going to move it above Bangalore's. Maybe maybe I'll do that. Um Yeah, I I think I'm just going to leave it at that. This tier list was super small and and short and to the point. So I just felt like doing it. It's like a quick little video. It's obviously it's an opinion, guys. So don't get overly mad about my choices in the comments i know that there's probably going to be some keyboard warriors out there like uh, how could you put gibby's club so low it's so cool looking it's like man it's my opinion go ahead and make your own okay this is just mine this is what i like my tastes um obviously everyone's gonna have different ones some people are gonna put lifelines drumsticks over everything like some people are gonna put mirage's statue over everything because i think it's hilarious like i get it but just with my taste, this is my tier list. So um, F tier, the, the caustic hammer, I, I really just don't like it. Okay. C tier Mirage's statue. It's fun. It's cool and all, but it, it doesn't wow me like the other ones do. Same thing with Gibby's club. Uh, Pathfinder's drumstick or Pathfinder's uh, punching gloves and, and the lifeline drumstick. They're different. There's some, there's something different. That's why I give them like a little bit boost of an up and they're a little bit cooler they got cooler animations and whatnot and then uh the og wraith knife will put a uh bangalore's knife is cool but i think they could have done something a little bit um but a little bit more unique with it in my own opinion just because everyone's getting like a knife it seems like um but then for me uh bloodhounds bloodhounds axe is absolutely dope and octane's uh butterfly knife is absolutely dope so that's that's my own opinion guys hopefully uh you we see some eye to eye in in one of these categories here or there or whatever but uh that's gonna be it for the video uh thank you guys for everything for watching supporting and continuing on this little journey that we are doing and uh that's gonna be it so uh thank you guys for everything appreciate all uh you guys vibing chilling vibing subscribing and check out the Twitch streams. And uh, without further ado, I will see you guys in the next video.